What's up guys, it's your boy Ty Skits here, and today we're playing Car Extra Racing Online. In today's Car Extra Racing Online video, I'll be giving you guys the V2 of the Nomad GT, aka the 2020 Super. Now, I know a lot of people had a few things they didn't like about the first, <clears throat> about the first 2020 Super that I put out, but I literally just spent the last, literally I mean, just spent the last three hours working on this tune, trying to get it perfected for you guys, and it's finally perfected. Let me know what you guys think about this livery down below. This took me about an hour to do, like, on and off. I, like, did one part of it, did another part, and then, you know, it, at the end of the day, it just came out to this. I think it's pretty dope. Let me know what you guys think about it, but if you guys want the Nomad GT, this car is on PC, Xbox One, and PS4, so if you have not updated your game, um, you might want to do that. But, as you guys can see, right here in Class 5, we have the Nomad GT right next to the Shadow XTR and the Carnage 7C. Now, I know a lot of people have been asking me, Ty, can you do this tune? Can you do that tune? Can you do this tune? Just know the tunes are on the way. And um, I've got a 20K special coming after this video. I just want to say thank you guys for 20,000 subscribers. Like, I'm not able to do anything super big right now, but I promise if I am not able to do anything, like, you know, right around the corner or pretty soon here for 20K, for 25K, bruh. I don't know. Some something crazy is gonna happen. Oh, that's all I know, bro. Something crazy about to happen. It's about to be lit. That's all I know. But hey, man. Say, man. I'm gonna show you all this tune. So like, make sure to subscribe, turn on post notifications, and drop a like. Let's get into it. So front spring length is gonna be nine. Rear spring length is gonna be seven. Front spring stiffness at 115. Rear spring stiffness at 120. Uh, quick tightening of front shock absorbers and rear shock absorbers at 5500. Quick retraction of front shock absorbers and rear shock absorbers at 5,500 also. Tightening of front and rear shock absorbers at 6,000. Uh, retraction of front and rear shock absorbers at 6,500. Front toe 0 0.40. Rear toe negative 0 0.19 or 2,0. As close as you can get it to 2,0. I try to get it to 2,0, but it just, I don't know. It'd be like glitch and see, like, look. It's all glitchy, bro. But um, front camera negative 5.59. Rear camera negative 1.34, front and rear anti roll bar at 45, caster at 10, Ackerman angle 26%, max steering angle 64 degrees. Now, I know a lot of you guys are probably wondering while you're watching this video, does this car do 360s? Does it do reverse entries? Because I know the first one didn't do reverse entries. Yes, this car actually hits really, really clean 6,000 DP reverse entries and really, really clean uh, 360s. It's it, bro, like, when you guys see, oh my god, I can't, I can't even put it into words. Front and rear rim diameter at 20, front tire width at 325, rear tire width at 285, um, <clears throat> front tire pressure at 177, rear tire pressure at 186, front and rear rule adhesion at 120, or whatever adhesion you want to run, I mean, it's up to you. Front wheel track zero, rear base negative two. Uh, front tire profile 30%, rear tire profile 25% for the engine, you guys already know what to do, man. <clears throat> Engine tune-up is going to be 5%, max torque is going to be 5,200, rev limiter is going to be 9,500, turbocharger yes, turbocharger air pressure 3.0. Transmission diff lock ratio is going to be 1.00, funnel drive is going to be 4.00, gear 1 is going to be 3.73, gear 2 is going to be 1.44, gear 3 is going to be 1.16, um, gear 4 is going to be 1.06, gear 5 is going to be 1.01, and gear 6 is going to be 0.98. For the brakes, your brake torque is going to be 3,500. Front brake bias at 70%. ABS no, and launch control tandems. Four tandems, I mean, no. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, that's the tune, man. So if you guys like this tune, and if you think this is a really good tune, make sure you let people know. Share this video with your friends. Share it with your other car extra for racing or PS4 you know, friends that may have the game, I'd really appreciate that. Share the video, make sure to drop a like. And like I said, man, if you're new, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications. But the video is not over just yet. I'm going to be going into a training room and actually hitting some skids real quick. Just so you guys can see what this car is made of. So I'm going to go on Cami Road and let's get sideways. <clears throat> Orange cream soda. Drink of the day. Alright, so, as you guys can see, man, we got the 2020 Super. It's looking really, really clean. Like, already off the bat, like, bruh, look at that angle, my guy. And this is effortless. You don't even really need to, like, 
don't need to use the e-brake, you don't need L2, you don't need any of that. It literally will like turn and transition smooth enough. Like I'm not even using the e-brake or nothing right now. Like literally all I'm doing is shifting, slowing down, going fast. Like bruh, this car with this tune is literally incredible. Now the V3 will have probably like, I don't know, like probably just a better transmission. It'll probably just be faster, but People are still getting used to this car, so I didn't try to aim for like too much speed, but I did make the transition, I mean the, I did make the transmission a lot better than the last time so that it would be faster, but not too fast, you know, because that could be bad, but um, overall it's a really good tune, it hits the jump on East Togger really nice, it also can tandem really well, which I kind of have a sneak peek at something like that coming after this video, so... Hopefully you guys are sticking around because I've got a pretty lit montage on the way for 20k, no cap. But um, yeah, that's gonna sum up this video. This has been your boy Task Against my first impression on mine. And today I showed you guys the best also drift for the 2020 Supra, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.